Hello, my name is TJ. I am the senior trainer here at SmartFit. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to build a report for a new patient. For those of you who spend much of your personal time writing patient reports, this could be a way to give you your time back because we will capture your reports in real time as you work with your patients. Let's begin. First, sign into your SmartFit account. Then connect to your SmartFit controller. Now, let's cover how to set up a patient. Select the Active Patient tab, then fill out Patient Profile, including any notes you would like to make about the patient. Then select the Done tab. Select the back arrow button, then the blue Save button, and it will take you to your list of patients. Select the patient you're working with, so he or she shows up as an active patient. Now I'll show you how to access the free activities in the system, or create activities and assign them to this patient. The first activity will be selected from our list of video supported free activities list. The second activity will be custom built for this patient's condition. Now for the first activity, we will access our free activities. Select the rehab folder, then select SL side foot drive level two. Once satisfied that it is correct for the patient, save the activity and enter the number of repetitions you require. Select OK to continue. Now let's customize an activity for this patient using our target selection feature. Access our build tab and choose the selections button. We are connected to a SmartFit Mini, so I'll choose the mini image in our app. Choose the Add Selection symbol, then activate your targets for the new activity. Any targets not highlighted green will not be in play during the activity. Select the blue Next tab, then name this arrangement of targets, and select which target will trigger the start of the activity. Select the Done button to continue. Select OK, and it will take you to your list of saved target selections. Access our Play tab and select a category of interest. Change the standard settings, then select our new target selection. Create it as a saved activity. Name it and describe its purpose and how it will be played. Now I'm going to show you how to pull these activities into the patient's program, which will be run when he or she comes in for treatment. The benefit here is that when this is set up in advance, you can focus on the patient while SmartFit executes the program for you. Select the Build tab and select the Program option. Name this program and select the amount of repetitions. We will not choose to save this as a baseline program. We will cover baseline programs in another video. Select the Next button. Import your activities list, then choose whether you want to save it for the future or just use it once. Now select the Add Activity symbol at the top right of the app. Then choose the activity we created for the patient. Select the number of repetitions, then select the Build tab. This option is asking whether you want to make this program visible for all patient profiles and specifically for this patient. This option will allow you to select which patient you want to assign this program to. Select the patient, then select the Done tab. Let's take a look at how to run this program while giving you the option to make subjective comments as the program executes. Select the Play tab then scroll across the top of the screen and choose the Marked Programs. When you scroll over the Marked Programs tab, the programs you designed for this patient will show up here. 
Select the program and you will notice your selected activity list. You are ready to go as soon as you select the play button. Since the first exercise was selected from pre-designed activities, a video will run showing you how to perform the exercise. The activity will begin as soon as the first target is activated. Choose whether you'd like to add subjective comments. Cycle your way through the program. In the next video, I will show you how to generate a report to reflect the data collected while this program was run.